Hello everyone, I'm Suzanne Neufung with GBTA and welcome to the Berlin Conference. I'm here with Patrick Diemer who is chair of BT4 Europe. Uh, welcome Patrick. So, Thank you very much for having me. Let's dive into some questions. Congratulations on your announcement last week. Uh, let me know what some of the objectives, what are your main objectives? Yeah, it was a big day last Wednesday when the 13 business travel associations from across Europe came together to form a new association mm -hmm. with the objective to lobby and to advocate in the capitals of Europe for the business travel industry. Hmm. Uh, are there specific topics that you're focusing on? Yeah, we have set ourselves a priority agenda. I believe we need to do some foundation work as to how much business travel is there in Europe. Simple things mm. like how many travelers do we have, how much money do we spend on business travel, how much business in general is generated for the European economies. That's not known to us at the moment. That's an area we want to work on. And on top of that, once we have the foundation laid, oh, we think the recovery from COVID, sustainability and digitalization are our main threat, uh, okay. main threats. And of course, GBTA will be a partner foundation, uh, foundation collaborator with BT4 uh, Europe, as we have been with, with the various groups. Who are part of your 13 association partners? Sure. Let me first say, I really appreciate to be invited uh, to this interview by yourself, uh, because you have been quite supportive uh, when you observed this development happening in Europe. And we want to have a first-class relationship to the other associations of our industry. And let that be GBTA, who has a crucial role to play uh, in Europe and also on the, global, um, on, on the globe. Um, and there are other associations we'd like to have good partnership with, like ITM in the UK. Mm -hmm. The 13 have really been all business travel associations in continental Europe. So, yeah, we can go through the list, but, you know, the Got ones it. you know, Around Germany, France, yeah. Italy, Spain, the Nordic countries, the Benelux okay. countries, Switzerland, Austria. So Very Brussels focused, as it should be, because so much happens here on a national and international level within Brussels that you are here where the action happens and with your national policies making that difference. Indeed, it's Brussels focused and many of the decisions which are important for business travel have moved away from mm. the local capitals mm. from to Brussels but it's also London now that the UK is not in the EU any longer we also need to influence London when it comes to allowing international business travel in and out of the UK of course I think uh Brexit as a topic won't end for a while, and I think that international travel, the cross-border, is where the complexities of business travel really happens. Um, the goals for the year ahead, uh, where do you see your next 12 months? Now, first of all, we have to do some groundwork uh, to get our name out, to start how we co can col uh, collaborate with GBTA on a day-to-day -day basis is something yeah. we need to have some um, um, hands-on experience. The same is true with the um, the decision makers in the uh, European Commission, in the European Parliament, which are Im, uh, important bodies in, in Brussels to influence. I think there's some groundwork to be done. And uh, we will certainly in the, few, in the next few months publish a few white papers on those priority areas which we have identified. Restart from COVID-19, uh, sustainability and digitalization. I think all of those will be ones that will tap into expertise on both sides and will make our voices be louder as a result of this collaboration. So yeah, I, I think that's, that. that's certainly true there. The industry itself, also GBTA, has done important work in these, in these areas. The issues are not new, mm -hmm. but we think to influence decision makers in Europe, it, uh, it takes uh, also, on, on top of what we, the, the industry already has, a strong voice of uh, the business travel associations. Yeah, exactly. Thank you, Patrick, so much for joining us. Thank you, everyone, for viewing uh, from the broadcast studio today at GBTA conference with VDR in Berlin. I'm Suzanne Neufang with GBTA.